Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for March 5th of 2023. Well, it is titled Jupiter and Venus over Italy. So what do we see here? Well, this is image of the sky taken from Sicily and looking out into the sky, we see a number of stars, but two bright objects that really stand out. And those are at the middle of the image. And those are two of the brightest objects in the sky after, of course, our sun and moon, which are the very brightest objects. And those are the planets Venus and Jupiter. So we see here Venus being the brighter of those is a little bit down and to the left of Jupiter. And this is when they were very near their closest approach together. Now, when two objects in the sky come close together, then we call that a conjunction. So depending on how close they are, and in this case, they were about the width of the full moon or so apart around that kind of distance, which is relatively close, although of course, there are much closer conjunctions, including things like occultations, which occasionally happen when one planet passes directly in front of another. Now, while we see them close together in the sky, they are nowhere near anywhere in together close together in space. And that's because they are in completely different orbits and at widely varying distances from Earth, and just happen to be located along the same line of sight as we look out into space. So even though they appear very close together, there's no chance ever that the two could collide. The two orbits are completely different and never interact. So even though they look close together in the sky, it's just a matter of perspective as we're looking at here from Earth. Now they are beginning to get further apart now, although over the course of the next month, you can still see Jupiter and Venus relatively close together as they have now switched positions. Jupiter for the beginning of this year was higher in the sky and has been sinking lower over the course of the year. And Venus is getting higher and higher. So Venus will become more and more prominent in the night sky as we head into May and May it will be very prominent uh, high in the sky above the uh, sunset and giving us the very prominent evening star that we will we will see over this spring and into early summer before it continues its orbit and then begins to f fall lower closer into the glare of the sun disappearing uh, sometime this summer and then reappearing as a morning star in the morning sky. So a chance to see these take a look over the next couple of weeks. You can still see Jupiter and Venus out very prominently in the evening sky after sunset. So that was our picture of the day for March 5th of 2023. It was titled Jupiter and Venus over Italy. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be balancing planets. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then. Have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.